think that I shall never see whichever is truly the world's oldest tree. Splitting hairs over the splitting of trunks leaves the official title in a bit of a funk. The chestnut tree of 100 horses is the oldest known chestnut tree in existence. Located in San Alfio, Sicily, the tree is estimated to be between 2,000 and 4,000 years old, which, if you ask me, is a pretty wide range of uncertainty. But if the title is specifically the oldest chestnut, then whatever. The Jomonsuji of Yakushima is estimated to be anywhere from 2,170 to 7,200 years old, making it one of the oldest, if not the oldest, tree in Japan. Give or take, I don't know, about 5,000 years? A bald cypress named Senator, located in Longwood, Florida, is estimated to be between 3,400 and 3,500 years old. George the Mew, bald but not old. Bill Nelson, old but not bald. Florida hasn't seen a senator that old and bald since Stephen R. Mallory II, am I right? Prometheus, a great base in bristlecone pine, was 4,862 when it was cut down by the U.S. Forest Reserve in 1964, leaving nothing but this massive dead stump. Nice going, Forest Reserve. Prometheus is survived by a younger sibling, a 4,841-year-old great base in bristlecone named Methuselah, which now holds the title of the world's oldest non-clonal tree in the world. Non-clonal, as if you didn't know, means that the tree grew from a seed rather than through vegetative cloning. Methuselah is not only the oldest non-clonal tree, but the oldest non-clonal organism on the planet. But if you allow for clone trees that have sprouted from older trees while retaining their original root system, then the title of world's oldest single-standing clonal tree goes to Old Jiko, a Norway spruce located in Sweden. Old Jiko's roots have been carbon dated to be 9,550 years old. Although if you consider that many trees often split from one single trunk into many, then the world's oldest tree is a male quaking aspen in Utah named Pando, or the trembling giant. By appearance alone, Pando may seem more like a forest than a tree, but it's actually a clonal colony made up of around 4,700 stems spread out over 107 acres, each averaging around 130 years, all sharing a single root system over 80,000 years old. There is a clonal colony that could be older. The 100,000-year-old Posidonia Oceanica would take the oldest tree title, although being a herbaceous seagrass and thus lacking any secondary branches, it's most definitely not a tree. When it comes to trees, is the whole more than the sum of its parts? Or is it even less? Is it possible to miss the forest from the trees when they're one and the same?